My name is Wayne Harris, and I am the Systems Administrator for Woodland Joint Unified School District. I am also your Area A Director, and just like you, I am a CSEA member. This is actually only the fourth year that I've been a member of CSEA. I'm gone from home a lot. My wife is, she knew it was coming, so she's fine with it. My daughter knew it was coming. She's more upset whenever I go without her. Woodland is about 10,000 students, about 1,600 staff members. It's a rural area, like we actually have one of our elementary schools that is sited by orchards. What I do as a system administrator is I help maintain the software, I update the servers, I help maintain the email servers, I keep all the technology equipment working for both staff and students. I also implement the new technology that comes through. One of the favorite pieces of software that we have is called SysCloud, and what it does is it scans the Google Drives of the students and staff, and so that way we can be aware of if a student's talking about suicide or if they're being bullied. They need help, and unfortunately, they don't feel confident enough to actually talk to someone, so they write out their thoughts, and luckily I see it, and we get them the help that they need. I may not have daily contact with the students, but the things I do on a daily basis do affect them. If I don't do my job correctly, they can't access the software they need to get their education, their Chromebooks won't work, their documents won't be there, their teachers won't be able to get to their emails. I'm originally from San Diego. My mother was a bus driver. She worked for San Diego Transit and then Chula Vista Transit before we moved up to Sacramento. We used to move every year. Apartment complexes, they offer you the special move-in deals. So we would move every year because that's what my mom could afford as a single mother with four boys. This job has actually changed our lives, my family's life. Because of this job, we were able to buy our first house. None of that would be possible without the union. That's why I am more than willing to give back as much as they need. And that's what I'm here for. From where I started to where I am now was a domino roller coaster ride. Three years ago, the first CalGen Summit was coming up. I applied for it. I was selected to show up. From there, I got assigned to the scholarship committee. From there, I met Martha Penry, the former Area A director and she talked to me about the union and what it meant to her. And not only speaking to her, but speaking to everyone else and seeing their passion for it, that made me wanna belong and participate. I started volunteering to do whatever they needed to do. I became the alternate area director. I became a regional rep a year after that. And another year after that, here I am as an area A director. I am a volunteer. I don't get paid to do what I do for the union, but I would still do it. CSEA means a lot to me, it really does. There's a lot of members that this is, it's everything. And all we need is more volunteers.